The backdoor Roth is commonly used by high-income earners to circumvent the income limits on Roth IRAs. It's perfectly legal, having been codified into law by the IRS and approved by Congress. So what is a backdoor Roth and how does it work? Hello everyone and welcome. I'm Mike Ballou. Roth IRAs have many advantages over traditional IRAs, but they're not available to everyone. People who exceed certain income limits are ineligible for Roth IRAs. The backdoor Roth is the only way high-income learners can play in any Roth reindeer games. With both a traditional IRA and a Roth IRA, your contributions and investment earnings grow over time. When you retire, you owe taxes on a traditional IRA, but no taxes are owed on a Roth IRA. You get to keep every penny. Another advantage of a Roth IRA is there are no required minimum distributions. Required minimum distributions are government-mandated withdrawals made each year after you reach a certain age. Required minimum distributions result in higher taxes. So how does a backdoor Roth work? As we've said, high-income earners are prohibited from directly contributing to a Roth IRA, but there are no income limits on a Roth conversion. At its core, a backdoor Roth is a Roth conversion. It's not as complicated as it sounds. I do a backdoor Roth every year and it only takes a few minutes. Let's go through it step by step. If you do not already have one, you need to establish an account with an online broker. Any one will do. Next, you create both a traditional IRA and a Roth IRA. Make a contribution to the traditional IRA, which you can do by transferring funds from your bank account. Finally, roll the funds in the traditional IRA over into your Roth IRA. That's it. You've done a backdoor Roth. Congratulations. You'll need to file Form 8606 with your federal income tax return. You can do a backdoor Roth every year until you retire. However, there is one gotcha you need to be aware of, the five-year rule. Converted funds must be kept in a Roth account for a minimum of five years before you can withdraw them. Failing to comply with this rule will result in a 10% penalty. This is something that must be planned for. You need to have enough in terms of other retirement savings that you don't need to tap into your last five years of backdoor Roth contributions. Based on the relatively small amount each year that you're allowed to contribute to an IRA, this shouldn't be a problem. So that's it. There really is nothing to a backdoor Roth once you know how it works. Wow, this was a short episode. How about a story to wrap things up? Meet the Thompson twins, Daniel and Chris. Chris was born one minute after Daniel. Now they're both 35. One day Chris said, Daniel, my brother, you are older than me. Do you still feel the need to save for retirement? To which Daniel replied, I can't fight this feeling anymore. Let's get it started in here. Chris said, I'm running against the wind with a Roth IRA. Daniel declared, hold the line. We are family, but I'm going with a traditional IRA. For the next 30 years, the brothers were taking care of business, working 9 to 5 and taking it to the limit on their IRAs. At 65, they decided to take the money and run. Daniel asks, how much do you have in your IRA? Chris replied, $1 million. Daniel exclaimed, me too. Looks like we made it. Daniel soon noticed that Chris was dancing on the ceiling and partying like it was 1999. He bought a little red Corvette, then he flew to Nova Scotia to see the total eclipse of the sun. Meanwhile, Daniel was living like a lonesome loser. Finally, Daniel said, Are you insane in the membrane? Why are you spending so much money? You've got to be running on empty. Chris replied, Do you really want to hurt me? How much do you have left? Daniel told him. Chris said, Me too. Jive talking, Daniel exclaimed. You're no good. How can you live like this and still have as much money as me? Chris replied, that's just the way it is. Let the sunshine in. I have a Roth and you have a traditional IRA. You thought they were the same, but you've got another thing coming. Daniel said, you're unbelievable. Chris said, you pay 20% in taxes and I don't pay any. Who's crying now? You should have gotten a Roth. Daniel exclaimed, if I could turn back time. Don't be like Daniel. Get a Roth IRA. It's definitely the way to go. Be sure to subscribe to learn more about retirement planning and personal finance. And always remember, a better tomorrow starts today and dreams don't work unless you do. Thank you for joining us. See you again next time.